makes Athens so unique and so very, very special. Because we are one community. We are a community that has a university. We are a community that has citizens who live and work here every day. And we show what we're really all about when we come together. Whether it's in good times or whether it's in bad times, this community rallies around each other. And that's what today is really all about. It's about bringing a community together to have an important conversation. Uh, the first thing that I want to do in, in, in my remarks is to lift up the first responders. You know, we take for granted the people that really, really care about us in times of crisis. Uh, we take for granted those who sacrifice every day on our behalf. Uh, they certainly get up each and every day keeping our community safe, uh, because, and we are safer because of their courage, bravery, dedication, and commitment. Uh, the three chiefs who stand with us today, uh, our fire chief and our two police chiefs, and all of the team that they represent, as well as all of the other first responders in Athens. These are people that sometimes we take for granted. These are people that we sometimes overlook for all that they do. And that is why it is uh, even more disheartening to me uh, that our students and others who participated in the fest put our first responders at even greater risk by some of the behavior that occurred at Palmer Fest. Our first responders entered a life-threatening situation during Palmer Fest. And it's because of them that there was no loss of life during the fest. We take for granted life far too often. Life is precious. And whenever our lives are put at risk, it is these gentlemen and the teams that they work with that are first on the scene to save us from the things that we do. So I certainly want to thank them on behalf of the university. I want to thank them on behalf of the community for all that they do each and every day uh, on behalf of us. Uh, Mayor Wilde and I decided to hold this town hall meeting to discuss the serious issues and incidents that recently took place and to answer your questions and hopefully to listen to what you have to say about what happened as well. The mayor and I deeply value our community and are appalled by the window that was opened on our community as a result of the dangerous and illegal behaviors that were engaged in by our students and their guests on April the 28th. Google Ohio University and you will find limitless, revealing images and videos that are offensive, frightening, and embarrassing to our students, to our distinguished alumni, our local community, and the parents and families of Ohio students and our graduates. We are better than this. People that live in the Athens community, whether just for a few years or a lifetime, reject these behaviors and their distortion of what our community is all about. We also know that it is not all of our students who are making bad decisions. Let me repeat that. We know that it is not all of our students who are making bad decisions. Last week, our student senate issued a resolution condemning these dangerous behaviors. The Senate resolution supports the stance of the overwhelming majority of the students, faculty, and staff who find this type of behavior disruptive to the culture of Ohio University and the relationship that binds our university and our city.